Yo, what's going on guys? Today's video is going to be a very weird one. Today we'll be looking at free to play Varina. I have not ran this in like two years, but I wanted to take a little look back and see how it looks. I am going to be, it's going to be more updated for 2019 standards, meaning Akasha, Opis, stuff like that. But we are going to be taking a little look at it here. I'm going to go to menu. Now this is the part we're going to be running. The characters are not free to play friendly. They have two limited here, Europa and Folia, both of them being on separate banners. I know, but I just want to take a look at it. Just look at it in 2019. So I am bringing the units that I want to run. Sorry if you wanted like a pure free to play one, but I, yeah, I, they're good units. I want to run them. Um, now the summons, I, I, I tried to bring water bunkles, but I'm going to show you what happened. We're going to try to replace it, right? Now I need water bunkles for the water attack up, but they don't exist. So it's like, Gotta improvise what we have. We're using whale bunkles. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um, the pool we're gonna be running here is three fimbles. I know. I don't think that's optimal at all. But I'm doing it anyway because I don't care. <laughs> I want to run what I used to run, and I run three fimbles. You guys know that. So we're running three of them. Um, I think you run two now, but uh, hey, I'm running three. We are running the opus with stamina on it. Yes, the dark opus weapon is a free-to-play weapon. Oh, I don't think it's the best main hand for this unless you have the uh, damage over time. Um, stamina just heals, so it doesn't really help you that much, in my opinion. But it's the only main hand I really was going to run out of this. It, I thought about running Seraphic, but it, it doesn't really work with Lily, so it is what it is. We are running the uh, Granny Bow only because I couldn't find anything else. I wanted to put a Genbu there, but I don't have the Genbu's done properly. I don't have their... Uh, the, the new skill on them. So we're just gonna just work with this, see how it goes. We're running the Ultima with stamina, uh, auto attack up, cause why not, I guess. We also have the Magna weapon here. This, this, this pool is a mess, but if you, hey, if it's old school free to play, it's how I used to do it back in the day. So let, let's go do a little run of Athena and see how it goes. It's been so long since I've done this. I think. I think I didn't really start investing into Varuna until Ultimate Bahamut came out because back then free to play Varuna wasn't that bad really. It was like it was good enough. You throw on SR Bunkles, you do decent damage. You weren't like overpowered or anything, but I don't think Mercs would help. Mercs didn't come out until like a month or two before Ultimate Bahamut, I think. Well, they were already out, but they weren't full limit break, I think. But people ran like Durandal. Oh, wrong, wrong boss. People ran Durandal, Slander, or whatever it's called. It's like the weapon that got power crept. It, I think it was like medium, no, it was large attack up two and medium double attack rate, I think. It's been a while, so I don't remember. But I remember people running that for like pay to win Varuna and then Murk came out and then everything just changed. But so right now at the beginning, our damage is going to be is very low because we don't have defense, uh, not defense, we don't have water attack up. <laughs> Since there's no bony toe, it takes a little bit of time to get our water attack up. I'm actually going to delay this if I can. Uh, oh, I messed up. Europa should be slot three. This may be a problem. I don't know if it'd be that big of a problem, but it may be a problem because of the fact that um, Foldy is going to have the the Gembu Fist hurting. Oh, what? Whoa, 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 what is Huh? Is that the right pool? Is that the right pool? They hit that hard? Wait, no more. Huh? I guess because it's low defense, right? I feel like that makes sense to me. I so I expected my main character to do good damage. Generally, your main character will do good damage because of Folia, but I didn't expect all of them to do good damage. I mean, honestly, with no water attack up, that's not bad. Do keep in mind, our damage is going to drop at eight turns because of the granny bow. But honestly, I'm surprised. 
we don't get the we don't get the insane like uh the insane Ogi damage. But for auto damage, not bad. We'll see how it looks in eight turns though. Eight turns we're gonna have the damage drop, so. Right now we're gonna turn what? Four, I think? Sound like that. Hmm. Yeah, it's, it's not it's not that bad with no water attack up. Let me get water attack up, man. I guess it's really just because of the characters though. Like I don't think this will be nearly as good if it wasn't for the fact that Lily is very strong and uh Europa is a very strong unit too. And Folia. But honestly, I, I, I'm surprised. I thought it'd be a lot worse than I uh, remember. It's been so long since I ran it. But it's really not that bad. <laughs> yeah. It's really. <laughs> I, I was expecting way... Okay, here we go. So, we just we just lost Folia's buff. Because I didn't... I, so, right now, Folia's in slot 4. So, she's being affected by the uh, the Genbu Fist. Now, that was my mistake. It's supposed to be Europa in slot 4. But, hey. You learn something right there. You know? You learn something, I guess. But, to be honest, the damage is not, like, awful, I guess. It's, it's, I'm kind of... It's weird, right? Because of the way the game is, I don't know what's good damage anymore. Because some elements are hitting 1 million autos, <clears throat> light, and in some elements, they just don't do that. So what is good damage now? Like, I honestly don't know. Like, is 600k good damage in 2019? I, just, I honestly don't know. Keep in mind, you have stuff like Moon, right? So, um, 500k is because my moon is only SR, right? So, if the moon was higher, it'd be like 600k. But because the moon's not higher, that's what we're capping at. Like people always forget that, like, like your your Arcarum summon doesn't matter a lot when it comes to damage cap. But honestly, I'm it's not bad at all. I, think, I don't feel it's that bad. For like GW or something like that. I don't think, I don't think it's that bad. We are past turn eight now, so this is what like the damage is gonna some sometimes be around. Yeah, I, I don't really think it's that bad. But would I build this in 2019 though? It's like that's the question, right? Because this this team setup it doesn't work for one turning, and I feel like a lot of the game it's a, around like trying to kill DW EX plus in one turn. And I don't think this team is be like the greatest for that. I need to look at free to play Magna and see how it is. It's been a while since I played that pool as well. So maybe if I, if I take a look at free to play Magna, um, I get a better idea on how I feel about this. Cause I don't, I don't know how good free to play Magna does in uh, 2019. Cause I don't play with it. So you can see the damage starting to drop off a little bit because we don't have water attack up. Like you're heavily rel well, we did have water attack up. Huh? Am I smoking? Okay, now the damage. Now this is looking more like what it should be. Okay. What turn are we on? And a turn, right? Where turn 15? Huh. So it takes 15 turns for us to really see a drop in damage? Or is that because of Europa's buff not being there anymore for scale 2? We'll have to fix scale 2 again and see how it goes. No, look, the damage is back up now. And that's, that's only with Lily's Ogi. <laughs> yeah, I, I really don't think it's that bad. So like, like you have all this health. Like you have, you have really nothing to worry about. I really, I really don't think it's that bad now. 
Maybe guys, I'm smoking, but I just looking at it. I, just don't, I don't think it's that bad. I have to try, try it in high level content. Maybe that's what I'm looking uh, missing. It's like I'm not trying it in high level content. So it's like maybe my my perception is a little bit warped. Now keep in mind, it's not the fastest run because I am talking. So in case somebody's like, "Oh man, you're at eight minutes in, you didn't kill it instantly," and blah, blah 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 blah. Yeah, stop your whining. But yeah, I'm talking, so I'm not really focusing too much on the fight. I am utterly shocked that it's not that bad. I'm really not. Now keep in mind, you need to have like bows, and if you take damage, I guess it could be a problem, right? But. Just looking at it, I don't think it's that bad. But I, I don't know though, because it's no. It's kind of hard. <laughs> I honestly can't tell. Like, I don't know what. What is good anymore? Because <laughs> personally, I'm looking at this damn, and I don't think it's that bad. But for some reason, something in my mind is telling me it's like. It's bad. It's bad. It's bad. I don't. I don't know why, <laughs> but something in my mind is telling me it's bad. But I, looking at the damage, at, it's just like I don't think it's that bad. I really. I really don't. Now it, it probably because I'm so used to the king, the Kengo build. So, and anything's better than the Kengo build when it comes to autos. But we don't get like the what, five million OG. That, that's very important to keep in mind. But this this has so much like like you don't have to worry about anything. You have all this health. <laughs> like you have all this health. You you really don't gotta worry about nothing. I don't know. I really don't know. I'm gonna try out a Magna free to play and see how it goes. But to be honest, that wasn't a bad run in my opinion. It did way more damage than I was expecting. You know, I'll, I was expecting around 400k autos around there, around that area, but hey, hey. Strong. <laughs> Free to play strong. Even though, you know, there was the whale bunkle and not the normal SR bunkle. I don't got them, sorry. But hopefully you guys enjoyed that. Um, it was a good watch, I guess, in my opinion. I'll see you guys next time. And if you liked the video, leave a like or a comment or something. Thank you and goodbye.